brothers and sisters, uh, I posted yesterday a message about cancer, but when I was doing the editing, I cut most of the message and actually the video was about nothing. So I'm correcting it. Uh, thankfully, not many people watched it. So hopefully now that I have fixed, people will watch. So this message has been cut since October last year, but because um, I didn't have depth of knowledge on uh, cancer's history, cancer the disease history, I didn't feel that comfortable on uh, sharing the message. Anyway, so it goes like that. Sons and daughters, cancer is not a bad thing a bad thing if you have been diagnosed know that your body was designed to warn you and if you think back now how many times and how many warnings has it given to you take this opportunity to seek my face and thank me for the healing and the warning cancer has given you it is time to change your lifestyle your body is my temple I am calling you to seek my face. If you don't listen, your body and continue destroying my temple, cancer will destroy you, even though it is not bigger than you. Hypocrites, the philosopher, chose that name because there is a spiritual meaning to the word cancer. The heavens declare my glory. This man wanted to use the word kaakinus, which has a deep spiritual meaning, to link to something that is considered negative, like a disease that takes over. This man did that because he knew my kingdom will take over and my kingdom is a just kingdom. Hypocrites' motivations were dark. But I will shed the light now. Cancer tells you something's wrong and that things must change perhaps the food you eat or the way you think what does my spirit do children if you allow me to live in you my spirit tells you what is wrong in the same way cancer does are you listening my spirit however is more powerful than cancer you have the power to cancel it and destroy it on my son's name. I hope you have been blessed uh, by this message. Uh, like I said, I received it October last year, but I didn't have a, no a lot of knowledge and I wanted to understand a little bit more in depth what it meant. Uh, and it took me that long. God continued putting on my heart that I had to release that. Uh, I hope you've been blessed. You have the power in the name of Jesus to heal cancer, to destroy tumors, to reshape the cells of your body with everything that it needs for healing. You have the power to think differently. You have the power to change what to eat, to change everything that you do in your life and to have more positive outcome in life. And you have the power and you have the faith to go through that and come the other way victorious in the, in the mighty name of Jesus.